Welcome back, everybody. Time now for Great Day Food. Now, here's the question. What's for dinner, <laughs> Ma? Doesn't have to instill dread or send you running to the drive-thru. Yeah, yeah. This is for me as much as it is for all of you. I learned a lot. I met up with a big, wide dietitian who's also a mom, and she shows us how we can get a healthy, cost-effective dinner on the table in minutes without the stress wow. with some easy meal solutions. Take a look. So no more drive-thru. We're going to find solutions that are making it as easy as ordering out. And you'll save money and be better for you, too. That's right, absolutely. The, the main thing is that it doesn't have to be complicated. You know, as long as you go into the grocery store with a plan, this is what we're going to have for the week. Um, it can be easy, affordable, and nutritious. Step one, make a plan. Write down at least three meals you want for the week before you come to the store. Fruits and veggies are easy, fast, and healthy sides. So whole foods are fast foods. The produce aisle can be our friend. Salads are quick. And a lot of times you have them pre-made. Absolutely. And really, when you're building your plate, what are you going to have for your meals? They should be half your plate is fruits and vegetables. So those are going to be you know, full of water, fiber. They're going to keep you feeling full. And they're just so good for you. Big Y has plenty of pre-cut options. Or try frozen or canned. Things that are going to be in your pantry, in your household, that you don't have to worry about it going bad. You don't have to worry about it, uh, you know, prepping it. It's just there for you. It's ready, and you're, you're good to go. I mean, kids always want snacks after school, but if you just put out, like, some apples and peanut butter or even the old school celery, I mean, those are things that are really quick. You don't even have to heat them up. Absolutely. Yeah, just go back to the basics. Okay. So for easy meals, this rotisserie chicken is your friend and registered dietitian approved. Absolutely. I mean, in our house, we buy these often. They save us as a quick and easy meal. Um, and you can use them for so many different meals. So we do, you know, pulled chicken sandwiches. You can put them on your salads. You can make a quick pasta dish. Um, and it's just such a better choice than having to go out and, and order out. Right, and they're not fried. Also, if you're going to cut this, you would recommend to make it easy. Just, just do it once. You can do like three different meals one time while you've got the cutting board out. Absolutely, and these are actually easier to pull apart when they're still warm. So right when you get home, right when it's still hot, you know, pull the chicken apart, take it off, and then in the next few days, you have that lean protein to add to meals quickly and easily. You might not think of seafood as fast food, but it actually is. Fish can cook so quickly, and it's so healthy. Absolutely. I'm going to tell you a little trick. So when you're cooking seafood, there's something called the 10-minute um, the rule. And so really, it's one inch of seafood takes about 10 minutes to cook. So you figure if you have a small piece of, you know, a thin piece of cod or something like that, it can cook up in four to five minutes. You yeah. Dinner on the table. And this, so easy if you're really in a rush. This already has the vegetables, the fish, everything already in here. Throw it in the oven or the microwave. These are wrapped and ready to go. Yeah, exactly. Another time saver, making sure you have just some canned beans. They're cheap and easy. Absolutely. These are something you should always have in your pantry. They add a great source of fiber and protein to your meal. Uh, and you, you just can rinse them, drain them. That actually reduces sodium up to 41%, which a lot of people don't realize. Okay, so always rinse them and drain them. Yes. Yeah. And same with a lot of the other canned vegetables. We can rinse them, drain them. You can even roast the sweet potatoes. I mean, you can have a lot of the prep work done for you if you get canned. Absolutely. And, you know, if you, again, if you have these in your pantry and you come home from work, you only have a few minutes to prepare dinner. You don't have to sit and chop vegetables. You just open up a can, heat them up, and they're ready to add to your meal. These instant mashed potatoes are also a quick fix and dietitian approved because they're just dried potatoes. Think of all these frozen vegetables, sort of like your sous chef. Someone already chopped them. They even come in a steam in the bag, so you don't have to dirty a dish. I mean, it makes it easy. Absolutely. And not only are vegetables here, but also whole grains. So we want to make half our grains whole grain when we're building meals. So something like this microwavable brown rice. Again, like you said, you don't have to you know, get that sticky pot when you're making rice. You just microwave it, and you're good to add it to dinner. There's nothing wrong with breakfast for dinner or brinner, right? Brinner, yes, I learned a new term today. <laughs> but yeah, it's something my, my kids love. I think most people love breakfast for dinner and it's so quick and easy. So eggs. Yeah. Uh, what, what, what do you suggest? So eggs are a great source of protein. So again, you know, when you don't have time to maybe cook up chicken or steak or pork or something like that, um, you know, just having some e easy scrambled eggs, you can do them over easy or even make them into something like quiche or frittata. Um, but, you know, you're getting that food group uh, for the protein and then you can just make sure you're adding other food groups. Um, so whether it's maybe some spinach with your eggs, uh, some fresh fruit on the side and just kind of making it more of a complete meal. 
The kids will be psyched when you say, pizza's for dinner, but this is better than delivery. And what we do at home is take the pizza dough and then actually divide it into four. So then each child can kind of make their own little pizza with their oh, different toppings. Yeah, so. yeah. And <laughs> everything's right here. You've got the sauce, sausage. We've got um, some pepperoni. And you said we can even turn these into other things like breadsticks. Absolutely. You can do breadsticks. Um, you can even, if you're making like a chicken pot pie, you can use the, the t uh, dough to make a nice crust on it. Um, but, you know, we're in the produce department. So when you're making pizzas, don't forget to add the color again with the fresh produce um, and you know add some nutrition to that pizza too and these bake really quickly in the oven they do it's like 10 minutes you know you put your oven nice and hot 425 450 uh, you know 10 minutes you don't even have to wait for the delivery driver right right faster and cheaper yeah good solution <laughs> yes <laughs> So I learned a lot, like just buying the frozen brown rice. I mean, brown yeah, rice is so good for you, but it takes 40 minutes to I make. Know. Yeah, you're not going to do it. So, <laughs> know, know. you know, the fact that you can just throw it in with stuff, uh, you know, quick sautés. Um, another time saver, use the Big Y app. There are recipes on there, and then the ingredients load right to your shopping list. Which is great. So